I dress like a junkie, but I'm not that Alice. I finally made it like Mayla. I'm dropping a classic like Keep Up a Data. But the O2, I go on these haters. This is, this is it? Yeah. yeah. Let's see. You don't even have like a, a front door or something? Mm. Just have a, thanks for coming, have a seat. Sure. We're here with uh, Crockpot episode four. We're here with some Kaliner. Just a, a little introduction. Uh, a lot of people say that his music is just for high school girls trying to find themselves. Thanks for coming. So you're from Lakewood, right? Tom Server. That's not, it's not the same thing? No. It's like telling a Clifton person they live in Passaic. I always thought it was pretty much the same thing, just that you can return stuff to land's end. You were on the cover of uh, Ami magazine, right? Yeah. Who did your makeup? I heard you're, la you're launching a cosmetic company called Simcha Eyeliner. Do you play any instruments or...? I try. You know, Shwaki once said, I don't play instruments, instruments play me. That's very insightful. You should make a, like a bumper sticker. Uh, let's talk about your first hit. What was it, fourth, fifth grade, English teacher, Rebbe, who did it? I think it was a babysitter. Wow. Yeah. And somebody told me that you were actually some Stark. Are you married? I am married. Uh, uh, uh. I, have to, I have to call my cousin back at all. I heard you tried to lose for autism and you won. Don't judge me. How do you deal with haters? You just have to respond with humor and sensitivity because there's clearly something that's bothering them. That's not what the IDF said when I asked them. What was wrong with Rabbah Bar's called ID? Why do you have to... That's actually, an interesting point. You were asking how to respond to haters, right? A lot of people hated it, so you can't sing a song from Shir Hashir. I, Rabbah Bar, did... So you're a singer, artist, father, and a, a, a late... No, I'm just saying, it actually looks really good. Oh, look, I should go watered down. You hear that sound? It's like... Sizzle. Amazing. For... for <coughs> for sizzle, my meal mart. <coughs> meal mart. Get blown away by every bite. When I first heard your song, um, Stand Up, when I saw it on YouTube, I thought it was like some Liner stand up. I was like, oh, wow, I'm gonna hear some stand up from some Liner. I clicked it, it's like, ooh, a thousand voices. Like, let me tell you, like another, here goes another guy, he's charading around. I thought you were gonna come with something original. I wanted to get you on the show specifically because I've been reading a lot of the comments and a lot of people are saying, oh, you're a bully. I'm assuming all the negative ratings are from like the bullies, like all the negative most ratings. Li are, most likely. Yeah. What do you say to some cholesterol? You know I'm a vegetarian, though. Yeah, yeah. You had uh, some Khalana 1, some Khalana 2, some Khalana 3. What's next? Some Khalana 4? That, that would probably make sense. Again, Shwaki, it's not happening. He's not coming to the show. Could you, you think you get that knockoff Shwaki guy? What's his name? Um, Uri Davidi? How about I? No, I, I'm a big fan. Okay. Big fan. What would you say was your biggest challenge in the music industry? Probably the lack of sleep. Lack of sleep! I can't help but feel like someone's leaking something, because I was working on an um, a anti-bullying campaign myself. The day before I was supposed to put out my song and my initiative, you would just Put out your song. Wow. Do you mind if I play it for you? I'd, love, I... I'd love to hear it. Diego, cue the, cue the song. Oh, it's another hard day at school. Some plastic napkin. Show me the laughter again. It wasn't the doctor. 
You know what's good about this talent? You never have that like completely awkward silence. You know, can you, I don't read the Ami, so can you give me like a little bit of background of your anti-bullying initiative? What do you do, what do, you do besides put out music videos and make money off it? Like what exactly are you trying to do to stop bullying? Very simple. We bring awareness to children that they have the power to stand up against a kid who's being a bully. That's for the children, for adults. Are you kidding me right now? Well, number two, like this morning on the way over here, we stopped off at a one of many schools that we stop in. Do a team? When I say we, it's just me, but I don't want to sound uh, like Elmo. You do. What does it look like? You go to the school, and what happens? Well, I walk into the classroom and I look at each and every boy. I say, Simcha, so happy to see you. Da, 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 da. Manda. What was that? We were like, let's pretend I'm a bully. You, you're eating your lunch, I come over. Hey, you punk rock, hey, you punk rock, you punk rock, you punk rock, hey, you punk, you little punk. You little, you little punk. So, I would then Your music stinks. I would, never was a fan. I would then tell me, don't. myself, okay. because I'm being bullied, don't listen to what this guy is saying. So besides for all that lib talk with the bullying and stuff, what, what do you find that's most fulfilling about being in the industry? Well, you're... He basically... Sorry, what? Yeah. What would you say was the highlight of your career, besides for the highlights that, like not makeup, the highlight of your career, music-wise? Probably when I met um, your idol for the first time. Rachnet? What was he like? What was he like? You want to just call him. Would you call him later with me, maybe? Mm -hmm. Rechnitz, if you're seeing this, I love you. And please write me back. My yeshiva my needs money, love you. Could you just do me a favor? Could you, could you hold this? Just turn it to the camera and say, say, Milmar brings me some ha. Just look. Myanmar brings me some ha. Thank you. How was that? Yeah. yeah. Can I keep? Yes, you can. You know something? Before I had you on the show, I was very apprehensive. Big word um, for my art school, West Side uh, Before before coming on the show, I was very apprehensive and very nervous. Like I have this like anti-bullying guy. He's gonna give me. He's gonna cramp my style. It's not true at all. It happens to be this is the most positive experience and. Uh, I really am surprised in a good way, not to take it in the wrong way, and I, I really, I feel great right now. It's honestly. amazing. So, no, 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 I only brought one shirt. Thank you. All right. <laughs> Where they find this guy? Beat as hot as yet, so let this fight. When I picked it up, I had to put it back down, almost burn my hand, I'm like, ooh, it's hot. People be waiting on me to release all these singles like BMZ on there of Tuba Shvat. Pinchas Lerkowitz, we're here with Shlomo Simcha. Liner. Just some Kholiner. We're here with just some Kholiner. And for all my uh, Hasidish, uh, Yiddish speaking furry little friends, I'm going to go Platz and I'm going to go Oskos.